After hearing that Jonathan Barris was going to be inducted into the Alumni Hall of Fame, I set out to see what his friends and former students thought about this accomplishment. How did Jonathan help this program grow into one of the most popular electives available at the high school? So just in a few words on why Mr. Barris was picked for this honor and maybe a short story to help cement it in. I'm sorry, yeah, who, who was that Mr. Mr. Barris? Mr. Barry from the, I, I know most of the teachers in the school district, but um, I'm not sure I know Mr. Barry. Is he the Galvin? Uh, no, he's not at the Galvin. He teaches right here at the, uh, the high school. Oh, uh, maybe you're confused with the vocational school up the road. Just having a little trouble matching the name to the face. Uh, when did he stop teaching full time and just become a sub? He didn't, actually. Really? Oh, it's, you know, it's so hard. It's been 10 years, you know, and if, if somebody stops teaching there after my freshman year, you know, you kind of forget the names. It's, it's been a long time, you know, so. He never stopped teaching at the high school. He's teaching there going on 10 years now. Really? While I was there? Uh, now, what department did you say he was in? Uh, the visual arts department. Oh, you mean like the old AV courses? I, I didn't even realize we still have those anymore. You know, he saved me. You know, people use those words, but he literally saved me. You know, when I was struggling in English or when I couldn't make sense of my math classes, you know, when more than ever I needed a teacher and a friend, you know, he was always there. Remember when I was writing my essays for college, you know, every single one of them, they were all about Mr. Estabrook. You know, how he'd take students like me under his wing and really try to... Mr. Barris. Bless you. Uh, as I was saying. I just wanted you to give me some, um, you know, some feedback on Jonathan Barris being inducted into the Alumni Hall of Fame. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Jonathan Barris? You have to wait a minute. Oh, I remember him. I'm um, a great teacher. Um, everything I learned about politics and government, I can trace back to him. Uh, he always challenged the students to think creatively about socioeconomic problems. He had some radical ideas, but he was always willing to listen to us. He was always willing to say, hey, question that and question authority. And I just think so much of my analytical thinking and so many of my political beliefs stem from his classes. And, you know, one quick funny, funny story. I'll never forget um, when I got a C in his American history class. And uh, Anthony, Anthony, he teaches TV production. Uh, he teaches TV now? He went from history to TV? That's no, unbelievable. No, he always taught TV. Don't, don't you remember? You were at, in at, class for four years. At the high school? Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. Okay. <laughs> remember he, he taught TV, multimedia, Swift 3D? I took all those classes with him? Yeah. Hey, oh. you, don't, you don't remember? So this isn't about Mr. Esterbrook? No, Mr. Barris. Mr. Barris? He's the one retiring. But when he leaves, who's going to take over the biology department? Oh yeah, Mr. Barris? Oh yeah, I have them to thank for the career I have today, you know? Good job, good pay, I'm, I'm really loving what I do with myself, you know? Look, you even got the TV producer's award. Look. Oh, I did? Oh, this is, this is nice. Well, if he taught me so much and I won this award from him, why did I end up in law school? Jonathan wasn't a very strong student. Yeah, I'm just so proud of Mr. Barris. He deserves it, totally. It's not like I'm not the head of the department or I've been teaching here way longer than him. It makes... It makes complete sense that the video teacher would get picked for this rather than the actual artist. Sure, total sense. It's clear that the visual arts department has continued to grow under the guidance and creative drive of Jonathan Barris. Even through tough fiscal times, the television program continues to be a strong elective choice at Wakefield High School.